How did it feel cutting that through our van? <laughs> yeah, the middle bit was okay, it went quite quick. It's just for the struts there. Did not feel wrong to be doing it. <laughs> a little bit, a it little felt, bit like... It felt wrong watching it. <laughs> is it right? It's close to the end. <laughs> yeah. It'll all be okay in the end. Hi. the paint. Yep. done. Our van has a gaping hole in it. <laughs> Ready for this bad boy to go in. almost ready for the uh, window to go in. Well, gotta treat it first. Oh, treat it first and pop it Prime on. Prime it. Boom channel. He's done all the edges with the um, file. So the window was in, it was a bit stressful getting on there so we didn't film that part. The mastic was really really tough, we had to get our friend to come and help us do it because Shane's arm went completely dead. But then we put the window on, it splattered out a bit in a few places but we've managed to clean it up and it's looking good now, it was just a bit of a, a, bit of a pain in the ass. That was the worst it? experience I've ever had. <laughs> that, was, that was not fun. <laughs> And they say it takes roughly two hours per window, but that was um, just a little over three hours. Yeah, but you didn't expect that because I've never done it before. Well, yeah, exactly. You, you can't. But that U channel was the wrong size. Mm. It was way too big for that for that back window. It'd be fine for the sides because there's two skins. This one it needs to be a lot thinner, but it's not what they sent me. It's Saturday on a bank holiday weekend. It had to be done. So that's to be squished in, and that's the first part of the problem. Which meant the ceiling had to be a little bit closer to the edge because it was so big. Mm. And now it's kind of gone right to the edge so you can kind of see it. So I'm going to have to bead it, which is not how you're supposed to do it. But 
It's the only way it's going to look right. Yeah.